everyone and welcome to a new play now today with a game called Fight Night. Yes, Fight Night. This is a game that was on Kickstarter up until a few days ago. It succeeded, It's it's been funded, so it'll be released sometime next year, probably in June. It's a game made by someone called Thomas LeBlanc, and I believe that uh, a person helping with the uh, Kickstarter campaign gave us a link to the game on our Discord a while ago. But I didn't have actually time to get to it up until now, and I'm kind of sad because, well, I really would have liked to play this even earlier because it is a, a great concept for a game. Also, it looks amazing and sounds great. This is, um, well, how should I put this? Imagine if Punch-Out was a dungeon crawler or a roguelike -like 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 game. It's basically that idea. You play as a knight, then must travel through to this island and climb this tower filled with all sorts of evil things and kick their proverbial asses with his fists. Why with your fists? Well, the knight is some, somewhat cursed. Like he, whenever he picks up a weapon, it breaks. But uh, that's not really um, an impediment for him because this is a knight that can punch out basically everything, and you're going to see exactly what uh, what I'm talking about. Currently the knight is sleeping, so it starts off like uh, Morrowind, only you're not a prisoner. Oi, fight knight! Up with heal, you lollygagger! Arrows, WSD to move, okay, and space to punch. The thing about this game is that there is only one interaction button. Space, which you use to punch. And you can only communicate by punching. Har and good morning to ya! Look, lad, we're finally here and you're and you're, and you're done got what? And your gun out the light like well like a pile of bricks or anyway. Uh he he heard me. We cut him we cut up with the top what do you mean cut up with the tower? You've been chasing the tower? So Okay, so in this game you were actually I, I thought that the, the tower sprung up and you were going to it, but no, you're actually chasing the tower. The tower is something that moves around. Okay. Uh, care to take a quick spot on Okay, this is the tutorial of the game. This is how the game teaches you how to play. And it does it very quickly. And basically tells you exactly what you have to do. For example, you have to punch people. Move left, right, and punch. You can even go back and then forward and then do an uppercut. You can even do special moves when the game tells you. Punch, 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 punch. Now, it may seem chaotic and kind of repetitive, but trust me, this gets more amazing in a couple of seconds. Just wait and see. Okay, that was the... The longer you, you keep your attacks going, the faster you get. See? This is basically like Fist of the North Star. You can also press Shift to block. There should have been a yeah, da, 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 uh, sound effect in the background. You know punch me, I punch you. Okay, you also can also do uppercuts like this. See? Bam. Block. Oh yeah, and you have special abilities. Abilities like Starlight Special or the 100 inch punch. Let's try the 100 inch punch. Punch, 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 punch! See? See, that? that's... that's... that is poetry in motion. That is superb. That's punching done right. Man, have I, have I wanted a game that does punching right like this for a long time. It feels so good, so natural. Not like the stuff you see in games like, well, every other game. Okay, now, don't think I've got, forgotten about your little arrangement. I get I get you here and you get me all these special recipes. I, I keep uh, forgetting what his lesson was. Those big old myths can grab. Okay, so I'm supposed to find recipes for him. And those recipes will actually be translated into more attacks for me. Okay, uh, he's gonna move the boat around. I'm gonna have to disembark now. He's gonna move the boat around and I'm gonna be able to come back here and um, rest once in a while. And I'm gonna shut up for a few seconds because the music in town is amazing. Well, there's no... Okay, the music sh should show up when he leaves. Oh, oh, oh. 
is that not sublime? And I mean, it's it's super. Well, when it starts going with the flute things, it's not as great. But still, that beginning part, man, that that evokes so much atmosphere, so many memories, so much nostalgia. It it reminds me a bit of of Daggerfall. Even I don't. This this is more chip tune than MIDI up to a point, but it, it it it's it's somewhere along those lines, and it's it sounds great. Uh, by the way, if you want to make the graphics look more terrible, I believe you can turn down the death ring. Yeah, you can make it look even worse. <laughs> Which is okay, I mean, it can run on systems that are not, not very good, probably. Okay, let's turn up this back to the max. I also have a map, because this is a roguelike, like, like, like game. Currently, this room is empty. I don't know what its purpose is. And we're gonna meet someone. Ooh, there's a bit there. This is where you go back to the ship, I believe. See, this is the map. You can also punch door, like I said, you can punch doors and export stuff. We're gonna talk tonight behind me soon. There is no mouse work in the game, you just move by arrows and punching stuff. Like a real man. Let's talk to the oh, I missed the, the path. Oh, I'm actually supposed to be dropped down here, okay. Forward, forward, forward. This is where you would go back to the ship. Only the ship is currently not here yet. It'll be back soon, I believe, I think. Yeah, I think this is where I got it to ship last time. Can I drop down from here? Yes, I can, and I I did lose some health there. So you will... Uh, I think I did. Was that the health I just lost because of the um, the sparring? Okay, let's talk to this person the only way we know how to. Punch. Ah, now it's the time for your undoing, finish this! Wait, no, you're not an enemy. What are you? The Accursed Tower has ascended upon us. Uh, where are your arms? You are looking at them, girly man. No, not those arms, you fool. Where's your sword? I don't need a sword, I have my uh, my pythons. Ah, enough of this. More monstrous foes could exit at any moment. Were I not so quick to uh, to defend myself, he was he was saying, I might be among those captured. Did you arrive by water? No, I swam here with my large arms. We must leave at once, as the only remaining of uh, the only remaining of down watch, I must warn those as far away from here as possible. Blast! Another terrifying abomination has come! A skeleton! Fight night versus the dot dot dot. Ha! It'll be not much for my... I moved in quickly. Take my blade! And we try to get his blade. But it breaks in our hands because we are cursed! For we are the fight night. Oh lords, you've been cursed as a tower. Oh yeah, I'm... Oh yeah, so that's why I'm chasing the tower because the tower cursed me. To be the most awesome fist fighter in history. Take this, you goddamn freaky skeleton. Take this and more. That was just one skeleton, so it wasn't that much of a challenge. And this guy uh, is now in the fetal position because he's, well, can't get up. Are you truly cursed? Yes, I am. I will be alright. You bested that tower without even a Yeah, because I'm, I'm fighting. I don't actually plan on climbing the tower with no weapon. Yeah, I do. I did it in strafe and got actually quite a fun. No, so the, the, you uh, go back to the um, ship through here. And we can talk to the captain again, Captain Cook. So, Captain Cookie. Uh, glad to see you alive, clicking and punching or punching. Like I said, you can give him, um, can give him recipes that will unlock more abilities. I'm actually going to unlock uh, one now. Let's see, we used the 100 inch punch last time. Gonna disable this thing, gonna equip the clock knocker. And... No, wait. Because I love the interface of the game, like, you just point at things and your hand moves. This is so archaic, like, this is from ages gone by. Yeah. But it still works. Let's sleep for a while, regain our health, and then go inside the tower and kick everything's ass twice. Oh, the doors fix themselves after you leave the tower. And our night friend has left too. There's a library here. I don't know how to use it. Not only the music changes, but also the sound changes I want to go in. Okay, let's go inside the dark tower and punch everything. Gotta say again, I love the music in this game. The graphics aren't bad. Ooh, a bone defender. Well, Mr. Bone Defender, you're about to get boned. Is he moving away? Okay. Clock knocker. Yep. 
With just one mega punch, a clock knocker, I KO'd him. You notice that the game changes to a different, different, more isolated um, environment when, when the punching starts. It's more ooh, I can punch this. To, so, yeah, you can kind of tell that I was cursed by the tower because everything in the tower seems to be punch based, not just the enemies, but the uh, environments too. I can turn off stuff by punching them. I can't go through water unless I punch it. Can I punch the water itself? Yeah, man, maybe I can punch it. No, I cannot punch the water itself. Oh, ivory and ivory. Oh, you're gonna get it. You're gonna get it. Oh, you punch me. You hit me, actually, not you punch me. Want an uppercut? Here, have an uppercut. You goddamn dirty skeleton. Well, actually, you're kind of clean, but see, you're a skeleton. You don't have anything to get dirty. Two skulls. It's a start. Okay, this is where I came out of. Now, this is the right place. Anything here? No. Can I punch this wall to find a secret? I hopefully, hopefully there will be secrets I can uh, achieve by punching things. And there's a there's a red uh, brick here. Oh, more ivory and ivory. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna uppercut you from the beginning. Come on. What? Why couldn't I punch things? Okay, so it seems I have a limited number of uppercuts to do. But I can do this. I can multi-drift! Oh, I think they were blocking, actually. That's why I couldn't punch them anymore. Okay, so you still get damage when you block, but not a lot. Not as much. Okay, it's just getting harder than I than previously. Than was previously. Okay, so let's let's engage one of our uh, one of our special moves, the uh, Star Eye Special. Okay, that that didn't go out as go as planned. Oh, baby, this is going amazingly well. Yeah, I'm gonna need more health soon, so I didn't uh, do that well in that uh, fight, which is kind of sad. Can I punch at a distance? No, I cannot punch at a distance, sadly. Let's see what we're gonna find. Oh, there's a uh, there's a door there. This maybe leads to the oh lizards. They're like lizards, but worse. Oh, you're gonna try and make oh they're lizard wizards. That's an excellent name, lizard wizard. You're not gonna lizard wizard me. I'm gonna lizard wizard you in the face with my punches and fists and uppercuts. Lizard wizards. <laughs> More like dead by punching in the face with my punches and fists. I think that's a trap. I mean, it it sort of goes. Oh, there, there's there's a recipe there, but I can get to it. Maybe I can unlock the secrets of teleporting via punching people, like Goku. Okay, let's let's fist this. Yes, I know what I said. Oh, I think this goes back. I think that you can... Ah, oh, damn it. Sticks and bones. Okay. This guy is a bit more well equipped. Armored skelly. Okay, so I did get some damage. Have an uppercut. And you're stunned. Okay, you tried to attack me, but I blocked. I blocked again. Ha ha ha. Yeah. Gaming doesn't get any better than this. This is... This is amazing. This is absolute fun. Though, again, it should have the ability to just tear down the walls with your punches because you are extremely punchy and fighty and you're good at it, so you should be able to tear down walls. I'm kind of lost as, as well. I'm still on floor one. Did, did I go back? I think I went back. Yeah, I think I went back. Uh, so they only have one graphic for uh, for the floors. Oh, this is floor zero. Okay. So the stairs will always look the same regardless of uh, there's notorious <laughs> notorious rib. There's four of them, and I'm low on health. Okay, gonna have to unleash my Starite special. 
Yeah, oh, it. Not enough. I should have clicked faster and closer to them. Here's a knockout. Oh, that hurt like hell. No, you're not gonna get me. You're not gonna get me, Mr. Skeleton. I'm gonna get you and your little dog. Well, no, you don't have a dog because if you did have a dog, he would probably eat you because dogs like bones and ghosts. Oh no, that was Kubiru. He didn't like him either. Okay, Mr. Skeleton, you're gonna die. You're gonna die. Well, you're, you're already dead, so I'm actually doing you a favor. I'm putting you to sleep. I'm making you rest. And there's a... Um, that looks like a maiden insect lady. Let's punch her. Eep, the minotaur. I'm not a minotaur. Wait, you aren't that... Oh, I'm gonna fight a minotaur. Yes! Oh, this game gets, just gets better and better. What am I doing? Uh, doing here again. Oh, I remember now. I'm to record the creatures inside the tower like yourself. I'm not a tower being, but I got the last fleeing group of terrible beasts. I dropped mine. Oh, yeah, so that was a parchment I saw earlier. I cannot leave without my notes. Okay. So you do have quests inside this place, not just punching things until they're dead because, well, not that punching these things until they're dead is bad, but it, it's good that the game has variety. Oh, okay, so this place... I'm a little one again in the flooded aqueducts. Okay. Is this something we can punch? No. Bone def... Oh, I think I, I almost got out again. Okay, I'm gonna go heal. I wonder if the enemies all respawn when, when you get healed. So this is the exit, right? Yeah, that looks like the exit. Okay, I'm gonna go rest. Even a man that punches things to death needs rest sometimes. Not always, but sometimes. And they fixed the door. Too bad for them. Getting a rest. Could have just talked to that guy and rested. But you know, this is more immersive. Progress saved. Gonna go back to punching things. Because it's awesome. Uh, this this game just made my day. Like, absolutely. <laughs> Oh, I think that's a laboratory, from the looks of it, like there's a apothecary or something, but there's not. Oh, well, maybe I'm supposed to rescue someone from the dungeon so they could populate the town. Yeah, I think that might be it. This is so amazing. Ah, oh, goddammit, they respawn. If, if I'm going to have to fight these guys constantly again and again when I exit and come back, it's going to get a bit rep repetitive. Not as repetitive as Dark Souls because the combat here is better. But still, it's, it's gonna get a bit annoying. Okay, can I go here? No. Here, no. Mm. Here and on this side, maybe. Ah, damn it. Sticks and bones again. Okay, Mr. Sticky, you're gonna get punched. Oh, I missed it. Okay, so I have a limited number of um, uppercuts, it, it seems. You're gonna block me? I'm gonna block you too. Here, have a block in your face, which is now your ass, because I punched it all the way there. Aha, uh -huh, here's her uh, scroll. Seems the word must be a librarian. Oh, so she's the librarian I'm supposed to save. Okay, I get it, I get it, I get it. She. That's why the library was there, so I can save her and uh, maybe she'll work for me then. Can I punch this? No, I cannot punch this. Okay, can I go up here? This is where she was, right? Ah, damn it. Mortal lizard wizards. Okay, lizard wizards. I'm gonna have something special for you guys this day. It's called punching. And it involves your face. And your ass. And your face's ass. And your ass's face. And okay, that, that kinda hurt. That kinda hurt a lot. Like, I'm not gonna lie, that, that was actually painful. Okay, here's your scroll. I am... In the hidden moment, I dropped those three pages on. I simply need all three... Okay, you're gonna need all three of them before she goes back to town. Okay. Um, what's over here? Oh, actually, what's over here? Can I punch this? It looks punchable. No, not punchable. Oh, there is another scroll. Librarian scroll, okay. Ah, damn it, more Lizzo's. Okay, no time to waste. I'm gonna have to go right into the uh, the clock knocker. 
I missed my clock knocker attack. No, don't die. Clock knocker again. Star Eyes Special. Star Eyes Special. Punch everything in the face twice. And one more time just to make sure. Okay. This is, again, this is one of the best games ever made. <laughs> haven't fun, haven't had this much fun in a while. I'm, where is, oh, oh, there's an arrow that shows where it goes. Okay, okay. That explains things now. Now that, that's actually understandable. Let's punch this and open up the gateway. The waterway, actually, not a gateway. And now I have to remember where was the other scroll I saw. Because I have, I have a very low memory capacity in terms of RAM. Good storage, but not a lot of RAM, so I don't remember where the last one was. Oh, I saw it some oh, more Lizzo's. Okay, I'm gonna try the uh, Starry Eye Knockout Special again. Um, knockover. Bam. Okay, that worked. Come on, Mr. Lizzo. You know you don't want to... Okay, yeah. You want to die. By my hand. Also, by my feet. My book isn't bad either. You can buy that one too. See, this one goes there. That goes up. That's a button. That's another button, but it, it's fleshy. And that's... Hmm. Thought that was something there. Let's go back up and see if we can... Uh, find something else here. In the flooded aqueducts. Have we found any new... Okay, this goes back down. Ah, damn it. Notorious Rib again. Okay, Notorious Rib. You're gonna get notoriously ribbed in the face by me and my punches. And my uppercuts. And my double cuts. And my... I don't have enough strength to actually... Okay, now I can do... I can do a... Come on, come on, punch, 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 people in the face. Hard, harder. Gotta say, this, this is a game I can really enjoy playing. I'm gonna probably break the keyboard. I mean, the kill switches are not that great when it comes to resilience, but it's fun. Oh God, am I glad this thing got funded. It's gonna be amazing. Stupendous. Absconsus even. I don't know actually what that means, but still, it's gonna be it. Okay, so I disabled that. Um, where was the third scroll? I don't remember where I saw it. I know I saw it somewhere. No, I did. Just can't remember. I cannot remember at all. Maybe it was down there. Yeah, maybe it was down here. No, that's a dead end. Looking forward to, to the game having the ability to punch through things, through walls, like uh, Mighty Foot Engage from uh, Might and Magic. Take this, you goddamn dirty skeleton. Oh, that actually hurt. Here, have an. I think I couldn't uppercut. Okay, uh, you have to time it right to get the. Oh no, I'm I'm low on health. What shall I do? Oh damn it! So the game doesn't stop when you activate that thing. You just punch to reload. I hope he does an animation where he punches the ground now. Okay, developer, uh, Thomas, add, when you hit punch at the continue, add an animation where he pounds the ground, like he just slams his fist into the ground and gets up. That's all, and the game will be, yeah, and the ability to punch the wall sometimes. That, and the game will be perfect. That's it. This, this game is just too awesome for words. It's, it's superb, it's stupendous, it's, I wonder if, if it saved... No, I think it actually just... Um, I don't think it saved my progress on that quest, sadly. Items and ingredients. Ooh! What a second. Monster ingredients. Compro Ooh, that's what the, uh, the apothecary was for. So I can punch things. And get stuff. And then kill stuff with those things. I know it doesn't save, uh, it doesn't act like checkpoints, like you're, it acts like actual save points. So, um, I lost all the progress I did uh, since the last time I saved. Yeah, you go down, you dirty skeleton. Okay, and that's too far away to punch. 
Uh, I'm gonna have to go back downstairs again to actually uh, get there. Ah, Style of Bone Trio. We meet for the first time. <laughs> we meet at last. Aha, uh -huh. oh, you kid me. Don't kick me in the face when I'm down. Okay, just for that, I'm gonna do a clock knocker. That's a clock knocker for you. It clocks you in the knock and knocks you in the clock, both at the same time because I'm Fight Knight. I am the fist puncher. You shall not prevail. Man, this game is so amazing. Well, I, I don't actually think I can do more. Like, it's an awesome game. It's gonna be out in a year. What's what's there? That's there's someone there. Can I get them? No, I can't because the way is blocked. Oh no! Wait, it, it, was it just the the punch logo that I have to punch? Yeah, I think that was a, for a second I thought there was a person, a uh, sort of long nose, pointy nose, sort of robed figure. Maybe it was, I don't know, like if the game has graphics that sometimes are hard to understand. Let's do a um, Star Race special. Punch, 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 punch. Be glad I did not play this game on a keyboard with blue switches. Like I s it would have been so amazing noise. Well, my, my my neighbors are probably very, very thankful for this because they, they would have not slept all night because of the noise of this game. Still, um, this game is going to be out in uh, June of 2018. I believe it only cost around... Um, well, the... A early bird special. Oh, yeah. It's, it's going to be 15... Well, it was 15 bucks on... Um, on Kickstarter so uh, it's probably not gonna be all that more expensive when it gets released 20 bucks maybe who knows it's a game I wholeheartedly recommend it's it's a distilled version of punch out as a dungeon crawler it's amazing brittle and little oh we get combos now okay sorry special Punch the lizards, not not scaly. Punch the lizards, punch the lizards. Punch the lizards, lizard wizard. Get punched in the face, your lizardy lizardy face. And uppercutted. And dodged, and voila. Ah. <sighs> well, I'm gonna see you again soon with a play now of um, Eternal Space. It's a forex game. I've been well, Eternal Space too. It's that um, uh, forex space game I've been delaying to play for quite a while because I didn't have time. So uh, play now of it will probably be you know that's a character. Kind of looks familiar, like the way it's designed. So it reminds me of the mosquito from Rayman. I'm gonna be uh, probably doing a blind play now of uh, that game because I didn't actually have time to properly play any of it. I don't think I've even installed it right now. I'm gonna see you again uh, with that play now. Again, this is Fight Night. This is an awesome game. This is one of the best games ever made. Enjoy it. Be thankful that it exists. Be thankful that we live in a world where Fight Night exists. Where such a game can be made. Where a game where you punch everything to death in a dungeon exists and you fight lizard wizards. Goodbye.